George Landis, board certified plastic surgeon. With so much information out there about facelifts and facelift alternatives, separating fact from fiction can be difficult. To help you find the accurate answers you're looking for, here are the answers to some of the most frequently asked questions about getting a facelift. From how to tell if a facelift could be right for you to the best way to achieve long lasting results. First of all, can facial exercises work as well as a facelift? Well, there's always talk about performing various facial exercises that can tone and tighten your face, much like workouts at the gym. In a word, no. Signs of skin aging, like lines, wrinkles, and sagging, can actually be made worse by repetitive movements, and no amount of facial exercise is going to be able to get rid of these common signs of aging. If these are your main cosmetic concerns, a facelift or other minimally invasive treatments, like injectable wrinkle treatments, are most likely to be the best options. Next, how do I know if it's the right time for a facelift? So, if facial exercises aren't going to do the trick, how do you decide if it might be time to commit to a facelift? If your self-confidence is affected by the appearance of sagging skin or deep lines and creases, or if minimally invasive treatments don't seem to be cutting anymore, a facelift may be the most effective option. There's not an age cutoff for getting a facelift. As long as you are in generally good health, just about anyone at any age can be a good candidate for the procedure. You know it's time for a facelift when you don't like the look of your neck and your jawline. There's nothing short of a facelift that corrects the loose skin and neck muscles and extra fat under the chin like a well-performed facelift done by an experienced expert. Now, what's the recovery like? Well, for the first few days after your facelift, plan on taking it easy and having someone else around to help you. The general recovery period is about 10 days and stitches are usually removed after the first week. Most people feel comfortable returning to work and other normal activities around the two week mark. To help speed up your recovery process, make sure you're eating healthy, nourishing foods and getting plenty of rest and following your plastic surgeon's specific recovery guidelines. How long will facelift results last? Although no one can guarantee the time the results will last, the improvements of most facelifts typically last for years before a touch-up might be needed, say 10, sometimes 15. To prolong your results even further, try to stay out of the sun, wear sunscreen, eat a healthy diet, and talk to a skincare professional about which products might be right for your skin. Hey, I hope this helps. If you like this video, check out some of my others. Be well and be healthy.